Hi there guys, welcome to the Farrington channel. In this video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can connect your HiveOS rigs to NiceAsh and I'll also give you a simple uh, tutorial on how you can install NiceAsh OS to your rigs instead of having HiveOS as the operating system. So just to jump straight in here, just to make you aware, I got a comment from one of my uh, subscribers and they was asking for me to do a video in regards to how they can switch the HiveOS rigs to NiceAsh. Now, I'm already aware that if you try to connect your, you know, HiveOS, HiveOS does not support the profit switching. So if you wish to use profit switching between multiple algorithms, we'd recommend using NiceHash OS, which is also free to use for a limited number of rigs. Okay? So what that means is you can you can mine any of the individual algorithms that are, that are currently out there to mine, but you would you would have to select the individual algorithm that you would prefer to choose on. There wouldn't be an individual or auto algorithm where it would you know jump between each individual one of these on there. So just please do keep that into mind if you are considering to use NiceHash on your Hive OS. So first, you're going to need to create yourself a wallet on your NiceHash account. Okay, and you would find that by clicking your mining address once you have created yourself an account. So once you've found yourself to creating yourself an account, navigate yourself to the Wallets tab on HiveOS. Click Create, Add a New Wallet. And then what you'll do is you'll make sure that you'll insert your BTC address that is in your wallet information on your nice hash and then what you would do is you would select the coin that you would desire to mine so that would be the algorithm so if you wanted to you know choose a uh, kapow something something like uh, Equihash for etc uh, or you know blake or anything along those lines anything completely separate to eth hash right now which is you know unavailable to currently mine at the moment on on nice uh, with, with nice hash you can have to specifically select the algorithm that you would prefer to use so now that you're starting to create your you know wallet for for NiceHash and you've created that you've labeled it up. So what you're going to need to do now is next you'll need to create your flight sheet. So navigate to the flight sheet tab. Select NiceHash and select any other algorithm that you would choose. So you know for for instance sake uh, currently uh, I've got my 3090 at the moment currently running on Kapow. So maybe you would select Kapow. You would then select auto pull location unless you specifically wanted to set a location for where you are. And make sure as well that you have all the necessary parameters in place and then name the flight sheet so that you know which one it is and then press the create flight sheet that is here. The last thing needed is to apply the newly created flight sheet to your rigs. So navigate to the workers tab. Click on the worker, so this will be the nice hash worker that you just created. Navigate to the flight sheet and click on the rocket icon, which you'll find over here, to the preferred flight sheet. And then from there, once you press that, it should fully get itself off working and it should set itself working on the algorithm that you've specifically chosen your nice hash to work on. But as I just mentioned at the start of the video, that if you wish to use the auto switching function uh, when you use NiceHash, you're going to need the NiceHash OS. So, what you're going to need to do if you've used a USB stick or whether you've used an SSD or anything like that to install your um, Hive OS onto the rigs that you're currently using right now, what you're going to need is a spare device. So, all you're going to need to do is download the tool on the NiceHash website. I'll leave the link in the description for you guys. But the NiceHash OS flash tool is a USB flashing tool that allows you to create a bootable USB flash drive with NiceHash OS already installed on there ready for you. It combines flashing and configuration with other cool features like auto naming each next work worker with one increment. So how do you use a NiceHash flash tool? You never get to the minor section, press download minor, select NiceHash OS. So you'd go to here and you'd press your nice hash OS then you would select the flash tool so currently myself right now I am on Windows so I would press the flash tool for Windows 
and then I will ensure to copy my minor address that is here so you would use your own address not my address once you create in your tool what it will do for you once you've installed it I'll do this real time for you guys So, what you need to do is, once you've installed the NiceHash operating system, install a USB flash drive, okay? Select the drive that'll be on the device. Make sure to enter your own BTC address that is in your miner's wallet address. Name your worker, and then add any extra stuff. So, if you need to add uh, your Wi-Fi details or anything like that, make sure that you get those information added in there as well. Then, from there, click flash button. And then, once you put that inside of your, uh, your the computer or the rig that you have, it will fully start to load your NiceHash operating system on there. And you would just simply have to go step by step and just click next, next, and install. And it would fully, you know, be an operating system on that computer for you already automatically have everything set up and ready because you did this and you flashed it onto the USB and it will start auto algorithm mining for you so thank you very much for watching this video guys if you'd like to see further videos like this in the future please do drop us a uh, like a comment and a subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one